the big race of the day here. Here we go, lined up, and they're off and racing for the Darley Yorkshire Oaks of 2020, and Manuela de Vega looks as though she might tow them along. She's in front narrowly as they go through the first furlong, and settling down that behind her on the outside there is Love, with on the inside, just taking a little bit of a hold, frankly, Darling, that's her manner, though. Uh, rain back in fourth place, the yellow cap of one voice, followed by the grey filly Alpinista, and Franconia in last place. The field already strung out by about uh, six lengths as they go across the far side of the track. They're approaching the nine furlong pole now. And Manuela de Vega leading by a couple of lengths to Love in second place. Then on the inside is Frankly Darling who races together with one voice, the Nassau Stakes runner-up. And then behind them, Alpinista in the hands of uh, Ryan Tate and on the outside, James Doyle on Franconia. So Manuela de Vega, who's won both her starts so far this season, taking the Darley Yorkshire field, Yorkshire Oaks field along towards the uh, halfway point now. They're just past a seven furlong marker. It looks like a pretty decent pace being set here by Manuela. Love is continuing in second place. One voice on the outside of Frankly Darling, Alpinista and Franconia still looking on and all of them still traveling extremely well. Down the side of the course they go then, and approaching the final five furlongs of the race. Manuela de Vega will lead them round towards the entrance of the home straight now, with a couple of lengths in hand over the odds-on favorite love, the Guineas and Oaks heroine in second place. One voice is on the outside in third. Frankly, Darling tucked away on the inside. Just sitting a bit lower, James Doyle at the back there on Franconia trying to get her closer. Alpinista's trying to make up some ground. All of a sudden, they're beginning to close down on the leader, Manuela de Vega, as they flash past the three furlong marker. And Love, on the bridle, strikes the front for the first time here. Now shaken up here by Ryan Moore. Into second goes one voice from Alpinista to the grey filly in third. The others seem to be only finding the one pace. And it's Love who's stretching clear, approaching the final furlong and a half. She's up by three to four lengths. Alpinista is into second now with one voice trying to battle back but Love going further clear inside the final furlong. She's up by about five or six lengths and it's merely hand riding from Ryan Moore as Love goes on to win yet again. She wins the Yorkshire Oaks comfortably. In second place is Alpinista. One voice was third. Manuela de Vega next followed by Frankly Darling and Franconia.